Hi, we are from group 24. For our project 2, we choose the topic of lines, parabola and system. This is our group members. Our group leader is Brethney Elbert. I am Fazrin. Other group members are Muhammad Akhil Ashraf, Nur Farah Shahira, Nur Fazila and Konika. Under this chapter, we learn about lines, systems of linear equations, non-linear system and application of system of equation. Under subtopic lines, this is the important formula that need to be remembered. The first one is slope of a line, which is also referred to gradient. They are represented by the letter M. Next is the formula for point slope form, followed by slope intercept form. And next is general linear form. And we also have parallel and perpendicular line. Next is systems of linear equations. There are three different types of linear system. The first one is one solution. Next is no solution. And the third one is infinite solution. There are two methods to solve simultaneous equations. The first one is elimination by addition method. The second one is elimination by substitution method. The third subtopic is nonlinear system. A system of equation with at least one linear equation is called a nonlinear system. This is the example of solving nonlinear system. And lastly, the application of system of equations. Under this subtopic, we learn about equilibrium. Equilibrium is a point where demand and supply curves meet. Next is break-even points. The break-even points is where total revenue is equal to total cost. To find the profit or loss, total revenue minus total cost. The pen makers sell their product at $10 per unit and sell everything they produce. The fixed cost is $7,000 and the variable cost per unit is $20 over $9. Determine total output and break even point, then find the profit when 1,890 units are produced. So we need to carry out the information in the question. Step 2 find the total output and let Q be the total output. Selling price times with Q and equal to fixed cost plus total variable cost. So total Q is equal to 900 units and next we can find the break even point. To find the break even point we just use price per unit multiply with total output. So the total answer is equal to $9,000. And the last step, we need to find the profit when 1,890 units are produced. To find the total profit, we just use total revenue minus total cost. When output is Q, and replace it with 1,890 units. So the total of profit is $7,700. Therefore, the pen makers made a profit of $7,700 when 1,890 units were produced. Applications of systems of equation Example question A company sells a product at 10 per unit dollar Selling all that is produced Fixed cost is $10,000 And variable cost per unit is 25 per 10 Then of the question is Find the profit when 2,000 units are produced Selling price per unit is $10 Fixed cost is $8,000 and variable cost is 25 per 10. Therefore, the profit is $8,000 when 2,000 units are produced. This is the calculation formula, formula used. Total revenue minus total cost equals profit. In brackets, selling price multiply output minus fixed cost plus variable cost in bracket equals profit. Ten dollars multiplied by two thousand unit in parentheses minus eight thousand dollars plus twenty five per ten dollars in parentheses two thousand units equal profit. Down in parentheses twenty thousand dollars minus five thousand dollars plus five hundred dollars in parentheses equals profit. Brought down $20,000 minus $8,000 minus $500 equals profit. The total profit is $11,500.
that's all from our group thank you